Tonight, some top cops in the South Bay getting an earful from the community. They say a new state law designed to give them access to information is not giving them answers. Night Beats Maria Medina live in San Jose with their complaints. Maria? Yeah, some families say this new law gave them hope they would get some answers, but when some law enforcement agencies began to fight it, well, they felt they were back at square one. It's the body worn camera footage of the shots that killed Jacob Dominguez after San Jose police say the 33 year old ignored commands to keep his hands up, then dropped them out of view. The video released just last week, a year and a half later. Why can't we get the answers? Why can't they release the records? And according to Rosie Chavez, Dominguez's aunt, it's the only footage that's been released. She says under the new law, SB 1421, they've made three requests with SJPD for documents related to the case. All three times, she claims they've been told to wait. If there was any disciplinary action, if they've had any past records of um, misconduct or anything like that. And hold officers accountable. Tonight, frustrated community members, along with Chavez, gathered with law enforcement leaders, including the Campbell, Morgan Hill, and Sunnyvale Police Chiefs and Sheriff Lori Smith to talk about SB 1421, a law that says agencies must provide records of use of force and police misconduct. Police unions uh, have been uh, filing lawsuits uh, against 1421 and hoping to block people from uh, getting records. 1421 uh, has value and it will show that we as a law enforcement profession are doing a good job of, of policing our own, holding all officers accountable who need to be held accountable. For Chavez, she says she may not even read the documents in her nephew's case if she ever gets her hands on it, but she believes it's her right to know how Dominguez spent the last minutes of his life. The answers might not get what we want, but it's something that's related to his case and we want it. Now, there are some agencies that are complying with a lot, others that are fighting it. But I got to tell you, there were a lot of law enforcement agencies that showed up today willing to have a dialogue with the community. Live in the Nightbeat, I'm Marie Medina.